Today we're, we're doing a rodeo, and a rodeo is a driving skills for, for your regular frontline driving uh, employees in the solid waste industry. And they, uh, they have to get here by being accident free for at least a year. They have to have a good evaluation, at least a, uh, at least a meet standards evaluation. And, uh, and their absentees has to be uh, outstanding in order to participate in this rodeo. Most of your municipalities hold an in-house rodeo before this rodeo and then they send the best drivers they possibly have from their, from their company. Today they're going to be participating in some backing skills, some turning maneuvers, uh, straight line backing event. Uh, there's seven events here all together. One is called an offset and the offset's where they're going to begin at and that's where they come out of one set of barricades and they shift off to the right to go through another set of barricades and the, the distance between it is just the length of their vehicle. And this there is kind of to keep them you know, out in the field there. They're in tight situations, alleys around parked cars and stuff like this and this is kind of a simulated maneuver for working your, your truck through a bunch of parked vehicles out on the street trying to get down the road. Actually what they're practicing here today is, is somewhat simpler than what they do every day because every day they're in uh, 600 garbage trucks coming here every day. 600 transactions, 600 people unloading. And it's, uh, you know, it's, it's rush, rush, rush. Here today, they're rushing. They're the only people on the course. So this is going to be easy for these guys. I meant they've got to maneuver through cones. They have to maneuver through people every day. They have to maneuver through garbage and birds. And it's just a, a grueling job and, and very difficult. So this, we, we think this track to the, our guys will be very easy. You know, this event here goes a long ways in providing the safety for the employee and for the public that they deal with on a day-to-day -day operations. Uh, this is a driving skill, and we all know these solid waste vehicles are so big, they're so awkward, they're long, they're, they're, they have so many attachments sticking out of the side of them, uh, and they still got to take these trucks through some of the tightest areas possible, alleys, uh, behind buildings and things like this. By sharpening up their skills, it just makes uh, one of the drivers, the employee, uh, really performing at the best that they possibly can. It's giving them the hands-on training they need to provide that safe environment out there in the public and invite that uh, have that safe environment around their co-workers when they're working with them. They have them right on the back of the trucks or, or riding with them uh, inside. This, this, sa this provides safety all through, you know, it's, it's not just within the uh, organization, but the public itself is it's ensuring that we're doing everything we possibly can out here to make sure that the best drivers are using all the possible skills they can to be the safest out here in their day-to-day -day operations. Six days a week, these guys are out there, crack of dawn to the end of the day. Um, working in garbage, they are just the most dedicated employees. It's the most, I, what I believe is the most difficult job in the county. Um, working, again, in a smelly environment, a hot environment, it doesn't, when it rains, we don't shut down. When it's hot, we don't shut down. When it's dark and windy, we don't shut down. These guys are in the elements every day. so. Today, they get to show off that and show pride in their work, which they do every day. And um, the people of Polk County should know that these guys take pride in their work every day and are just, again, very um, happy in serving the citizens of Polk County. Well, it really does. Like I said, the stress relief on it, it is a great deal. I mean, it, and the county works with people, and uh, we we train our people very well in Polk County, especially in the landfill division, because it has to be due to the danger that's involved out here. If you win, you got bragging rights, a lot of them. Of course, uh, the Solid Waste Department of uh, Polk County has bragging rights on landfill, period. We're one of the best landfills in the nation, and we work hard to keep it that way, and competitions like this help us keep it this way. 